This guy's Hernan Cortez, widely regarded as the first, uh, well, the eventual person who conquered Mexico, which is a strange thing to say because it's not like Mexico was hanging around waiting to be conquered. But back then, Mayans and gold and all this sort of stuff. Now, what's interesting about this very unique time in, in history is that we tend to look on it in a sort of strange way because if you sort of read the details of it, weren't the greatest people, but we do glamorize it in TV and movies. We think of these big, beautiful boats and the white masts, and they come up to these virgin lands with the grass swaying and some beautiful women and all that sort of stuff. And the truth of the matter is, is that it wasn't the case at all. In fact, the crew, when they arrived, were very, very badly beaten up, uh, spent months and months on these crazy boats. Uh, they were lacking some very primitive technology that a lot of us take for granted, things like uh, air conditioning and uh, GPS systems and stuff like that. And as they were making their way up to the land, a couple of the people uh, who were on the ship moved forward to Cortez and said, what's the plan? How long are we here for? What's the go forward strategy? And Cortez did something really unique and interesting. He burned the ships. No going back, only going forward. Now when I heard this as a digital marketing guy, it really hit me in a very profound way because what I realized at that particular moment in time is that all marketing and communications that we're even doing in the online channel is pretty much the old way of advertising. If you think about what banner ads are, they're billboard ads or magazine ads, that's all they really are. If you look at email marketing, it's just like direct mail. I mean, it's very, very similar. In fact, why is it that we're using all of this very traditional way of marketing and communicating in a channel that I believe in, that I'm hopefully going to show you, is so fundamentally different from anything we've ever experienced before? And that was the sort of big idea I had, that now is the moment where we have to burn the ships. It's time to think differently.